Good morning, fourth graders. We're going to teach a, a card trick to you, and hopefully you get a chance to learn this and, and do it to your relatives over your winter break. It's all based on math. So I'm going to do the trick for Luke first, and then I'll teach you how to do it. All right, Luke, this is a normal deck of cards. You can see all the cards just like a normal deck, correct? Yep. I'm just going to make some piles. Nothing big about it. And I'm going to flip these piles over in front of you. Some are going to be big, some are going to be small. Sometimes I might just take the pile and bury it back in the middle. Doesn't really matter. Ooh, that was a really small one. <laughs> I wonder why. All right, we'll keep going here. Ooh, that was a big pile. Well, I tell you what, Luke, you can pick three piles. We have enough piles out there. You point to three piles. All right. This one, that one, and this one. All right, I'm going to take those three piles that you picked and get rid of the rest of the cards here. I'll put these in front of you. And it really doesn't matter what the order is of the piles. I can move them around a little bit. That's fine, whichever. I want you, Luke, to take two cards or two piles and flip the top cards. All right, now I got to do a little bit of magic. I'm going to take the cards. I'm going to tell you what the top card of that pile is. All right, so we're going to do a little bit of magic. Pocus, pocus. All right, no laughing. Here we go. time just to make sure well if I did this correctly and I read your mind <laughs> and the card that should be a two now flip the card Dan you may flip the card <gasps> ta da <laughs> ta da this is the trick you will learn. I will show you how to do that next. <laughs> 